coast clear. Nobody's here but us chickens. Look what I found. Hey, you talk about me like I'm a stray dog or something. You do look a little lost and scruffy around the edge. I think I'll have to adopt you. So how was the medical convention? Oh, uh, it was informative and dull. <laughs> because I don't golf, you know, I had a lot of time on my hands. Um, mm. uh, why don't you put those hands to work and go get us some take it? I'm really starving. Are you? I'm starving, too. I'd like to feast on you. <laughs> Save some for dessert. Okay. Like I say, I'm gonna go get some take it. See ya. Bye. I thought Cruz might still be here. No, he left a little while ago. So how did your dinner go and everything? Dinner was great. Everything else was uh, almost perfect. Why the look then? Oh, I don't know. Maybe I'm borrowing trouble. Because on the one level, Cruz is very attentive and he's in tune with my feelings and my thoughts. And he's very open to us trying to find our way in this relationship. You know, it's... <laughs> it's almost like we're exploring some uncharted territory, and it's not scary because he's holding my hand. <laughs> well, that sounds perfect. Yeah, it is. And then I remember that he's already taken this trip with someone else. <laughs> you know, I just, I can't help but wonder if he's not in the back of his mind writing a mental postcard to Eden that says something like, uh, having a wonderful time. Wish you were here. <laughs>